guys stay tuned because after we go ahead and review this awesome interactive T-Rex, we're going to go ahead and take a look at a huge box full of Animal Planet toys. Wow, it's going to be awesome. guys an awesome toy today take a look at this t-rex wow that is one of the coolest looking t-rexes i've ever seen whoa this is animal planet interactive t-rex he's got six exciting dino sounds motion and touch activated wow this guy is cool I love how, I mean, look look how he just, he's going to move. Uh, it doesn't have uh, batteries right now, or if they do, they're turned off. And then his tail is up here. It has three double A batteries, which are included in the set. It says, now you can interact with the mighty T-Rex. So here it's got like pressure points where you're going to touch in those parts. So six dino activated sounds, uh, two roaring, a stomping, snarl, a growl, and a farting noise. <laughs> Mouth sensor to activate motion. How cool. And here is some really cool T-Rex facts. Okay, let's go ahead and check this guy out. Okay, so let's see exactly what was in this package. So that is what he looks like before I take him out. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out some of the features. Once you turn them on, it runs through some of the features automatically. So let's check out the head bob again. So the eyes do light up. So in my opinion, that is the coolest part of this dinosaur. The one thing I really don't like, guys, they play the volume too loud, and it makes the speakers sort of crackly. You hear like almost like a crackling noise. So it's got six pressure points, one, two, three, four, five, six, with different noises. So just go ahead and touch it. 
And each each pressure noise will make different sounds. I mean they're all each one will make all the sounds, I believe so. So right there I got like six different sounds. Uh two different roars, uh farting. The farting is not that distinct though. So here's the pressure point. That sounds like a roar there. Another roar. I think that was supposed to be the fart, so not very authentic. There's another one. Chomping. Stomping noise. Roaring. But the nice thing would have been if they would have done a uh, different noise for each pressure point because it's kind of hard to tell what you're gonna get like if this was stomping you could just touch that one and get the stomping but you don't know which one of the six sounds you're gonna get so that is a little bit disappointing there but uh, anyways besides the interactive part this dinosaur is awesome looking on one side I will show you the other side uh, very Jurassic World uh, Hasbro type looking let's just say that but uh, really cool uh, authentic looking really big teeth there is some bleed off in the color there you can see it but you know for the price you pay I mean this guy it's not that bad at all I believe he was uh, 20 some dollars so it's not for Animal Planet it's not the greatest but you get a really cool figure for that price so if it's something you're interested in uh, I'll put a link below the video but it also is motion activated too so if you put your hand here he will try to chomp you but I don't believe he'll keep doing it well okay maybe but if I just hold my hand, so you have to actually move. If you just hold your hand there, it's not going to work. So, I mean, I almost wish they would have put a button where you could get the guy to chomp on demand. So that would be really cool. I mean, you could bend his head and have him chomp and his arms move. I'm wondering if... Uh, the arms just click into different positions. It, it doesn't actually control any head motion. So you could do it yourself, like I said there. Uh, light off orange eyes. So that is pretty cool looking there too. So overall, you know, it's not that bad. I really like the look. They gave it a really nice textured detail type look until you come down to the legs. I mean, the legs are really boring. It would have been nice if they painted uh, nails in this guy. But, like I said, once you turn it to the other side, it's like dino under construction. Just like the uh, Hasbro dinosaur ones, you have screw holes everywhere. So the motion activated part is cool. So here... I'm putting my hand close to it, so it does chomp down, so, uh, younger kids, I think, will really like that. Older ones, if you use it for display purposes, it's cool. I just don't like all the screw holes everywhere. That, that sort of puts it off. Uh, I'm hoping with the new Jurassic World toys from the Lost Kingdom by Mattel that they're gonna uh, go ahead and finally get rid of the screw holes. Here you've got the uh, speaker on the bottom here and here's where you got for the batteries. Like I said, they made the roar a little bit too loud so it almost, so there's, you get some static feedback. I don't like the fact that they did that. But other than that, you know, you're getting a cool dinosaur with uh, really cool motion activated features. So there we go.
Also, go ahead and check out this 50 gallon tub full of Animal Planet we toys that I've unboxed T in the past. The action wow. feature they are a the lot of fun. guys. And then next, we have this awesome Spinosaurus with the action feature here, the roar, and uh, his sail and his eyes here light up. And then we have the giant cobras. This one has a striking head and its eyes also do light up and it makes the sound. Then we have a freaky looking velociraptor here with roar, sound, and lights. We've got a giant gorilla that looks like King Kong. It has sound and lights on the eyes. And you could get him to beat his chest here. The next dino we have here is a giant T-Rex. Ah, oh, it doesn't have any action features. It came in one of the sets. And then a giant spider with action walking feature. If you push it, its legs really look like it's crawling. Oh, that freaks me out. And then we have a Dimetrodon with action feature. If you push it down, its mouth opens and closes. Here we have an Allosaurus with the action feature. If you push it, mouth opens and closes. And then we have an Animal Planet Bigfoot with action feature. If you push his legs together, he raises his arms and swings his club down. And then we have an Animal Planet Killer Whale uh, with action feature there. If you push down his fin, his mouth opens and closes. This would be like, if you ever been to SeaWorld, this would be Shamu. Then we have a Megalodon with an open and closed uh, action feature if you push down the fin here. Megalodon is like a huge prehistoric shark, so this guy would have been, would have been huge. And then we have the Sasquatch. This one has an uh, action feature. If you put a ball or something in his arm and pull it back, it's like spring-loaded, so it will throw the object you put into its arms and it could also hold the giant club here and the giant crocodile with snapping jaws if you push the button here like I said all these toys uh, I have full reviews on if you go to my animal planet playlist at the end of this video and then two giant scorpions with action features if you push the button on their back they have snapping claws Here we have a giant squid. It doesn't have any action features, but it does look really cool. And then uh, Leah Pluridon with uh, action feature here if you push the button. A giant elephant with a saddle for a rider. Uh, no action feature here. I mean, you could move its head by hand, but that's pretty much it. A uh, remote control T-Rex with sound and roaring action. Uh, it does come with the remote control. So with the remote control, you could have it walk and turn. So he is really cool. Here, let's take a closer look at his light up eyes. A uh, giant shark with action feature. This would be a tiger shark. And then an armor plated triceratops. A really freaky looking Dilophosaurus. And then a set with a jaguar, a lioness with a uh, action feature here. If you push it, its legs move, and a lion. If you push it, his mouth opens and closes. 
Then we have a uh, Paraceralophus with an action feature. A uh, giant Elasmosaurus with an action feature. If you push the button, he swings his head down. So this guy is a real cool. And finally, an anglerfish. This guy is freaky looking. If you ever watched uh, Nemo, this is a uh, big fish they find in the dark. He's got this glowing globe here. And then when it's revealed what he is, he's a huge fish with big, I mean, this guy is freaky looking and he is an anglerfish. Wow, guys, that was an awesome dinosaur toy. So if you guys enjoyed that, make sure you go ahead, click like. And also, if you want to see more fun videos, go ahead, click the subscribe button and the bell next to it to be notified when I make new videos. I've got over a thousand videos, guys. The majority are Jurassic World, Jurassic Park, Godzilla, King Kong, and Animal Planet. They are a lot of fun. So if you want to see more Animal Planet videos, just wait till this video ends. There's an awesome playlist. Or go ahead and check out the playlist on my channel. You guys are awesome. And I will see you tomorrow. Click the subscribe button below for a lot more fun videos. Also, click the bell button to be notified every time I make a new video. Click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos, and if you want to see even more, go ahead and click the subscribe button.